to vlog. We are in LA actively packing all the stuff to go to now to San Diego. This city I'm super, super excited about. I'm excited about the drive. It's gonna be partially on the ocean. I'm excited for you guys to come along with us to see if we like San Diego, if we like working from San Diego, and most importantly, if Chai like San Diego. There's a couple of dog beaches. I'm hoping that we're gonna be able to go there. Let's go. All right, beautiful lighting. We are charging in a mall parking garage. We've maybe been on the road for like 10 minutes because we just need to charge right now before we head out. Um, and if you think, poor Rebecca, there's no fills in LA. She's not gonna be able to do anything. Guess what I found? I found Phil's in Studio City. So that was wonderful. So far so good, been 10 minutes, but good. We are all packed up, packing from this Airbnb to go to the next one has been a lot easier than the first round of packing. I'll see you guys on the road. drive was like literally double what it was supposed to be because there was so much traffic. It was very stressful to be honest and then getting in here was a little bit, uh, there were some mishaps and stuff but we are here. Chai is here. <laughs> got here, we put our stuff in, we got tacos. Um, now we're gonna go on a little date night which I'm excited about. We're gonna kind of have fun this weekend check out san diego check out some neighborhoods where we would possibly want to live i think we're gonna try to do point loma north park la jolla normal heights and then we're probably gonna go to coronado because the beaches are very nice um <laughs> and chai is mad i think chai is not adjusting to the new place at the moment and there's no yard but anyway so we're gonna have um, a little date night tonight and then go and do a bunch of fun stuff this weekend as well as kind of adjust get groceries figure out how we're gonna work from home from here um, yeah. <laughs> places we were thinking about setting up so there's no like work from home station at this one so we're actually here um we're thinking that our pen will maybe work and then this is our bedroom here and then this room I, set up. I literally just put it on the ground here and then i'm gonna set it up so it's like a blank wall background one issue is that i need this table's kind of low and I usually, last time I used the chairs from here, but these chairs are very high. So I'm thinking the only really thing I can use is this. Okay, so like this is pretty low. It doesn't have a backing, but I think that would be like the only thing I could use. And I but I just wouldn't have any backing while I'm working. Well, maybe it'll give me good posture. I don't know. But that's like the only thing I can do. We're on a walk. This is what we found. It's not even one of those videos. But we did go to breakfast and our friends saw some people that he went to college with. So we had breakfast with them, um, which is just kind of ridiculous because 
yeah, you're in San Diego and you feel like you don't know anybody here and then you find some people. I am like currently doing laundry. If you cannot hear it, those like super loud laundry, extremely loud. Chai is taking a well-deserved nap because he did go to the coffee shop with us. He was super, super good. And there was actually a dead bird at the coffee shop. So that was not so fun. They cleaned it up, they got the bird. We are gonna go to the zoo because we love the zoo and one of our wedding gifts was tickets to the zoo. Um, so we will do that today. It's a holiday weekend, so it's gonna be kind of busy, but it's also supposed to rain next weekend. So it's kind of like, what are you gonna do? So we're gonna go to the zoo. Searching out for some coffee. The flamingos are turned into statues. So what should we do now? <laughs> Let's see the tiger. See the tiger somewhere. Mm. Like I want to see, you want to see the tiger? I want to see. Oh, I love the hippo. The hippo is so yeah, cute. Yeah, see the hippo for again. Somewhere on the trail. I think it's way up. If the hippo is under construction, unfortunately. I'm so sad. Same here. coffee and now we're taking this one to the dog beach in Coronado and we haven't taken him to the beach for a long time but I really wanted to take him and it's gonna rain for like a long time here in San Diego so we wanted to definitely go to the beach and do all that stuff before it just rains for like eight days <laughs> worked out for us but let me show you I think I showed you when I set it up what it kind of looks like and I will <laughs> let you know how it actually worked out for us this freaking stool has been rough but I've been making it work <laughs> this is not sustainable at all I basically kept everything the same way if you saw my LA video I had a mouse this time I remembered it and that was helpful. So we did use the bed. Meetings where I didn't have to be on camera or any like admin stuff, I went and laid over there and laid on the bed, which I don't recommend in general, but it was very helpful because my back with this guy was hurting so bad. 
I think my summary for San Diego is that if you can have the opportunity to live or work from San Diego, please take it. It's been amazing. People think San Diego and they think like just going to the beach all the time, which we did go to the beach, but we were here at like probably the worst time to be in San Diego. There was like this crazy blizzard. There was snow in LA. Like it was super, super rainy but still had a great time because we were actually based North Park, South Park area. And North Park and South Park have, especially North Park, has amazing, amazing, amazing food, places go to. There's just so much to do and so much culture that even when it rains, it doesn't feel that bad. I think a lot of people stay like in the beachier areas, which are really fun too as well, like Pacific Beach, Ocean Beach has a lot of fun and great things to do, but I think North Park and South Park are super underrated for San Diego. So if you are in San Diego and it's raining or you're having, you're like, I want to get kind of out of what might feel like a touristy area, go to North Park, go to South Park, go to University Heights. What are your favorite parts of San Diego? Do you think it's worth it? Where would you go if you could work from home anywhere in the U.S.? Let me know. Um, I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.